Hey everyone, today we are looking at an older budget graphics card, the R7 250 2GB. I'm comparing it to my Ryzen 3's Vega 8 graphics, which are integrated. And you may find this a little surprising. I have 8GB of RAM with my Vega 8, it takes up 2GB. So you'd think, you know, the R7 250 would beat it, right? Let's look at the benchmarks to find out. First up is BeamNG Drive. For the R7 250 barely beats my Vega 8 with an average of 30 frames per second, flows down to 0, and highs to 38 frames per second. The Vega 8 got an average of 28 and a minimum of 0, with a max of 46 frames per second. Next game is Portal 2. But the R7 stuck close to 60 all the time with an average of 59, minimum of 4 when we were in the menus, and a max of 63 compared to my Vega 8 with an average of 95, minimums down to 66, and a highest frame rate of 133. Final benchmark with Watch Dogs, where my Vega 8 crushes the R7 250. With an average of 25 FPS for the R7 250, and minims to 13, and a max of 162 FPS. Compared to my integrated GPU, uh, I got an average of 38 frames per second, and minimums of 18, and highs to 219. So there you have it. Two out of three games, an iGPU of a budget CPU beat a budget graphics card. This certainly surprised me. The iGPU made it so that the system would have less RAM to work with, but apparently that didn't make too much of a difference. Thanks for watching and see you next time.